The latest assessment of the once reliably frozen Arctic is causing alarm among climate scientists. In tonight's Eye on Earth, CBS's Roxana Sabiri reports the changes could ripple across the entire globe. The scientists say the changes they're seeing in the Arctic are undeniable and alarming. Snow and sea ice are rapidly melting. The long frozen tundra is growing green. And on the highest point of Greenland's ice sheet, rain was recorded for the first time last summer. Should we be concerned? Absolutely. Climate Should specialist Rick Toman helped write the annual Arctic report card, the 16th released by the U.S. government's National Oceanic and Atmospheric Administration. Even if some records weren't uh, broken, we did have um, in parts of the Arctic the warmest fall 2020. The theme is really continued disruption in the Arctic. Disruption, he says, to the lives of Arctic animals and people. The changes have already occurred. Um, they can't be undone um, in, in short order. Even wildfires are scorching land that was once permanently frozen in Siberia, which the U.N. says hit a record high of around 100 degrees Fahrenheit in 2020. The heat that we saw in Siberia in 2020 would have been almost impossible without climate change. The report warns if we don't curb greenhouse gas emissions, the changes in the Arctic could unfold elsewhere, with melting ice and warming water raising sea levels and speeding up global warming. So what can we do? We have to reduce very dramatically the amount of carbon dioxide that humans are causing to be put into the air. There's no doubt about that. It's late, but um, the, the best time to take action was 50 years ago, and the second best time is right now. The sooner we act to protect the Arctic, he says, the more we can keep dramatic disruptions there from cascading to the rest of the planet. Roxana Saberi, CBS News, London.